Big cat, the size of Alsatian, spotted in Burford. That's the fourth sight in this month. And this fascinates me because I've had a big cat experience myself. And I don't believe in ghosts. I'm not a crack nut. I don't believe in the Loch Ness Monster. I don't believe in yetis. I don't believe in the abominable snowman. I don't believe in pixies. I don't believe in fairies. I don't believe in Slenderman. I don't believe in Momo. I don't believe in willows or wisps. And I certainly do not believe in shadow people. But I do believe what my own eyes have seen. And these eyes have seen a big cat. And I'm not talking about your oversized tabbies. I'm talking about your pumas, your lynxes, your panthers. XXL cats roam in the English countryside as common as a common toadstool. I saw a big cat when I was about eight or nine and I was in the garden and I was just on my snake board sort of trying to uh, practice my snakeboarding skills. I don't know if you remember the snake board. It was similar to a skateboard, but more snake-like. And I just seen out the corner of my eye this black mass slinking, following the fence up towards the back of the garden. And I just stood there on my snake board and I froze. I put my hands on my face like this and I just screamed, Mum! Not talking to you. Okay. And Mum was like, what? what? Exactly like that. And I was like, I've just seen a big cat. That is uncanny, because that is exactly what she said on the day. The thought of those large beasts being out roaming our countryside is absolutely terrifying. It means that I don't camp around here, that's for sure. And I certainly don't sleep outside.